from a scoreline perspective, this was never in doubt. Earliest goal yet of the tournament. Uh, pop goes the world. All sorts of uh, uh, goals for Germany. They ultimately win 6 0. Uh, Ari Hingst was wearing her. German jersey, screaming and yelling. She had told me before the game that she thought that the trend was going to hold not to have these lopsided types of results, and that she thought that while Germany was going to win because, well, it's Germany, uh, she thought it was only going to be eins, zwei to, to null. Uh, and so this ends up being a complete rout, but not in like a, a route where it was embarrassing and not in a route where I think that the way that I now think about Germany is bolstered and improved after this result. A reminder, Germany is Doug McIntyre's dark horse Ooh. at this World Cup. Number two ranked, two-time World Cup winning Germany. <laughs> and he wonders, That's how Doug rolls. He wonders why Lakin Lippmann is getting all the plum oh, assignments. Oh, wow. Uh, but no, I was impressed by Germany. Pop got two goals, Buhl and Schuler on the score sheet as well. They did benefit from two own goals. Uh, so I thought solid start for the Germans, especially when you consider they were without their best player, Oberdorf, who I'm very excited to see later on in this tournament. Uh, so I, I do think Germany laid down a pretty good marker in this one. Yeah, I mean, I thought that they were they were efficient, and this was the first time that we saw a real elite team come out and kind of be elite. Until, by the way, uh, I guess until a couple hours uh, after that, which we'll get to uh, get to in a second. Uh, we all through the night we were joking on air about my. Uh, uh, about my power rankings and stuff like that. And while I was watching this German game, th th they absolutely started to go up and up and up in my uh, in my estimation. And to your point, it, this isn't just some team. This is already an elite team. But we've seen where elite teams aren't necessarily looking elite. And again, first games, early days. But as far as Germany coming in and kind of, uh, as John Strong during the uh, the game was saying, you know, planting that flag, show, uh, putting that marker in, this was definitive. This was Germany is here, and this is a Germany that is formidable uh, in, in a way that maybe they haven't been in the past, but one that uh, means you're going to have to look, uh, look at them.